so guys as you can see this is the positive input as you can see this is the switch this is positive input so as you can see guys this is the positive as you can see this is the switch and this is the negative input guys and here is our output wire just like we did in the first video guys and this is our driver oscillator circuits and transformer and this is our fan so we are connecting it parallel guys positive and negative as you can see this is the positive input wire and this is the negative as you can see guys to the internal MOSFET and this is our output from the transformer so i'm going to put a socket here and this is our switch and our fan so guys as you can see our circuit has been completed and these are the wire wiring connection for our inverter and this is the fan as you can see guys and this is the input connection like we did in the other video guys this is the uh, negative and positive guys and this is our output so this is the output and here is the switch guys so i'm going to cover it now then we are going to test our project guys So guys, as you can see, our project has been completed. And this is the output. You see output, guys. This is the switch. And here is our fan, guys. So we are going to test it now. So guys, this is our battery, as you can see. 12 volt battery, guys. This is the positive. And here is the negative. So let me switch it off here. So I'll switch it off using this switch. So this is 60 watts and uh, 40 watt bulb. As you can see, guys. So let me switch it on. So guys, our project is working. So guys, this is 60 watts. So guys, this is 60 watt bulb, as you can see. So guys, our project is working massively. So guys, this is 100 watts, as you can see guys, 100 watts to 30 volts. So we are going to test our project with it. So let me on it guys. find this video helpful please like share and subscribe guys and i will see you in the next video thank you as you can see the fan is also working